update on the um, paint on my skin. It's um finally. It's it's still lit a little bit like right there, but that's about it. I don't have it down here no more. It's not on the other side anymore. Yeah, it's that paint. Do not get that paint on you. Should have listened to the guy, but how are you supposed to paint upside down and not get paint on you? But um, I got a little bit more to do on the bottom. I'm going to wait till I um, can get the car on the lift to do it. I'm not going to do it on the ground like I did in the park that day. Um, update on uh, the top. I got this. Um, the sample came in. The guy sent me the sample from this place right here in California. He's a really cool dude. I talked to him on the phone. Um, when I when I ordered when I ordered the original material, this uh, Autumn Maple right here. He didn't. Um, he called me back and said he didn't have it. I needed five five yards of um, this auto maple vinyl material. He called me back, he said he didn't have it. He said he got this color right here. So I guess, I don't know. I told him to send it, the five yards of this, but looking at it in the sun, I don't know if this is gonna work. It looks the same as the car though, like that. Not the same, but but yeah, that's the this is the place right here. It's really cheap. I think it's like twenty uh, less than twenty dollars a yard. That's really cheap. That's the cheapest place I found. But um, in this color, that color is garnet. The original color, like I said, was uh autumn maple or dark autumn maple. But it should be good. If not, I'll just have to um another color. I know he's probably not gonna give me my money back. I I paid one one fifty two for this five yards of this. Like I said, that was the cheapest. Um this last time I made a video that um my amp was making funny noises at low volume. I think I'm gonna have to buy a new amp, send that one out to get fixed. I, I seen one online. I hope the guy still got it. Um, even if I order that, it's gonna take a while to get here because the guy, I think he's like overseas. So even if I do order that, it's gonna take a while to come in. But yeah, that's about it. I'm at work right now. I'm about to go in. See you next time. We'll see you in a little bit. It's on my way home from the shop. I'm stuck right here on the highway 195. My rear tire blew out. And when it blew out, hope that shit can get fixed. I got scratched there. Hopefully that shit could get fixed, but I'm waiting for my um, friend to come pick me up or bring back the tire. He took it with him to um, have a tire put on, but this is some bullshit. I got out of work yesterday and look what was waiting for me. Yeah, the tires came in one day. I couldn't believe it. Next day, um, vinyl came in too. Five yards of that Garnet vinyl that I might be using for my top. Um, I'm not sure. Now again, I'm not sure if I'm going to be using the vinyl because I found somebody that can um, probably do the um the rag top 
So I got to call him tomorrow and get a price and see if he can do it and when he can do it. But um, my friend uh, forgot about the guy. And I went to go see him yesterday. He said, oh, I know this guy. Um, so let's see what happens. Um, the guy knows what he's doing. That's what he does for a living. He does upholstery. So he knows what he's doing. But yeah, I'm going to call him tomorrow and see what's going on. Um, if I don't use this garnet, I don't know. Maybe I'll try to try to sell it on um online or just put it in the storage it was only 125 i hate to waste money like that since i need i need a transmission well transmission's working it's just funny when i put it in reverse and like i told you before the car vibrates but it does back up but I already got, I got to go actually get it. I told the kid Friday or Saturday. So um, I'm going to go pick the transmission up, put it in storage. And hopefully I don't need to use it. But it is not really that hard of a job to do. It's, it's a big job, but it's not hard. Um, Yeah, that's about it for right now. Um, I would go put the wheels on in the tires today, but I need, um, different, different lug nuts. The ones that I have on my car are different. They're the ones for the steel wheels. And, um, I need, I need different ones for this chrome. I'm probably going to get the chrome ones. They got different color ones, but... I'm not going to get all crazy with colors. I was thinking about putting gold in there, but no, nah, gold ain't going to work. Um, I'm probably going to order those as soon as I finish with this video online. Hopefully they get here fast too, because right now I still got that, um, that donut on the back of my car. But yeah, that's about it. Made it to the tire shop. About to get these tires put on. No more hubcaps. These cheap, thick white tires. Just left the tire shop. The dude the other day told me uh, $60 to change over the tires. And um, I told him I needed them balanced. He said, yeah. So um, I get there, he does the work. I give him the $60. He's like, oh, I need more than that. It's uh, 120. What the fuck, man? I just, you told me 60. Now you want to charge me another 60? Oh, for the balancing. Dude, I told you I needed the tires balanced now I'm, I still got the tires in the back of my car he didn't even put the, the wheels on my car all he did was switch over the tires there was three three of the rims the new rims had tires on them one was already off yeah it was some it's some bullshit but whatever I paid him because he was just gonna sit there all day and ask me for more money, so I gave him the other 60, but fuck that place. And uh, he he ran out when I was about to leave. He made me take the old tires. I, I wanted to just pull off on him, but I'm in East Providence and I don't want any problems. But right now I only got two, two rims on my car and two hubcaps. It's better, better than it looked. With that um, hubcap in the front and steely in the back. And um, the driver's side had all the um, hubcaps on them. So now I got two, 
two hubcap wire wheels on the driver's side, and on the passenger side, I got the aluminum um, honeycombs. But uh, my lugs, my lugs should be here like Tuesday. Um, hopefully they're here Tuesday. I ain't really worried about it. As long as one side is matching, I'm straight. I don't really care what anybody got to say. I got two of the same wheels on one side and two different ones on the other one. So what? Some more bullshit about the top. Um, I called the guy today that was supposed to be putting the top on, and um, he told me the material didn't get there yet. Um, I called him around 2 o'clock. Um, the place he had the material shipped to, I think they closed at 3, so he said he was going to call me back. Um, he didn't call me back, and sir, it's 6 o'clock right now, so... Obviously, I don't think he got the material, so the guy can only um, work because he works all week. He can only do it on the weekend, so it looks like it's going to be another week with me without my top. It's, I told you, this is crazy. It never ends, the bullshit. This just came in the mail. I didn't think it was going to come today, but... I think it's supposed to come Sunday, but it's here. This is a 1980s four-door cutlass grill. This is the older style than the one that I got. The one that I got is the 86, but the original was this one right here. But this one's supposed to be new. It's supposed to be new says in the e in the eBay description it says that it has tarnish on it so hopefully it can be cleaned I didn't even really want it I wanted a brand new 86 one but since this is brand new I couldn't pass it up I hope it's good but if not, I'll sell it or I'll keep it. I paid $75 for it. Plus, um, I had to pay, it came up to like 90 something dollars altogether. This thing looks shiny already. Shit, if it's that shiny, I'm putting it on my car. Still search for a brand new 86. 87. Yeah, this thing is shiny. Hell yeah, I'm putting this on. The only thing it didn't come with, I seen it in the picture, is the badge right here. It says Oldsmobile. Right here, there's the two mountain holes. And you know I need this. Can't get this anywhere. Can't find it anywhere. 
But yeah, this thing looks good. I'm gonna clean it up. I'm definitely gonna put it on. Oh yeah, this is way cleaner. But yeah, it turned out good. It's a good thing I bought it. Something told me to buy it. This thing's supposed to be brand new, but it does look brand new. It's just really old. Yeah, I'm definitely going to put this on. Definitely. It was early. I didn't have nothing to do. So I was like, fuck it. Just, um, let's put the grill on. Uh, on the old grill, I only had, um, what's this? Oh, yeah. Messing up my video with the copyright. But the old, the grill that I just put on there, I only had three bolts on there anyway. So it came out really easy. Um, this one is this one looks really good. I'm gonna end up keeping this one the, Like I said, the only thing missing is that little badge right there that says Oldsmobile, but This uh, I'm gonna take this Oldsmobile thing out because I hot glued that in there So I'm gonna get that out and put it on there But I can't do that right now because I don't got no electric out here and the reason why this is off right here is because I'm gonna try to put the red in the um, the emblem, the hood emblem, or whatever they call it. See how that works out. Josh hooked me up with the kit. See how that works out. But yeah, till next video. All right, the kit that the um, dude bought me. Um, he said maybe this will work for um, putting the red in the Oldsmobile. Both sides are missing. He said use this. I'm going to use this color right here. I'm just going to put some in these little, these little things right here. And put them in there and heat it up and hopefully it comes out good. Let's see what happens. Alright, that's the best I can do right there. These things came out of that hole like three times already on both sides. That's the best I can get it. Now I'm going to put it in the oven. It says for I think like 15 minutes and see what happens. It looked like it's melting real nice. Um, it actually looks like the same exact color that it's supposed to be. But I'm going to leave it in there more. And hopefully that um, fills out the whole logo thing, what I'm trying to fill. Hopefully that will all melt and come out looking good.